Don't be fooled by the calendar. There's only, there are only as many days in the year as you make use of. Charles Richards. What a nice little opening quote. <clears throat> Hello guys, this is Swordfish, and today I am playing the demo of Healing Process Tokyo, which is a game that's currently on Kickstarter. Their campaign ends in the middle of October, as usual, I have a link to it in the description. But it's essentially, it sounds actually like a very interesting concept. They're going for uh, like an interactive fiction storytelling sort of game, but in a very open, explorable world that lets you kind of like wander around and, and see what's going on. I don't know how much of that is going to be in this demo, but we'll see. Let's start it on normal. Every day we wake up and continue living the little lives we've laid out for ourselves. Sam L. Jones, creator, director, and composer. Cool. So, we all slow. have daily cycles. For those of us who have worked hard to get where we are, we're likely moving along, playing out our satisfying day to day routine. Casey Mustaine, script story editor, concept revision. We couldn't be bothered to give a second glance to those who just couldn't make it, or who thought the pressure was just too much. Igor Green, Pixel Art Animations Level Design. A year ago today, that was me. Niho Ame, But those of us who are successful and refuse to be beaten down by a challenge, we who rise above all adversity, even we have our moments of helplessness. Samuel Joe's voice of Charles Anon. Even we have times right. when we're broken nope. souls. Those periods where we're wandering bodies without a light to guide us. Joe Newbery, voice of Dan Jiro Sparky. Zach Diamond, voice of James Ford P. Leader. Hilary Archer, voice of Haruka. JP presents Healing Process Tokyo. Number one, the low point. This is intended to be in chapters, so I suppose this is chapter one. This is the old forest behind the university, but the last time we were here was so many years ago. The smell of the air, it's just like that day. I guess I can walk now? I can, hello. I love that my instinct is to walk backwards like every other game. So the concept as they introduced it in the Kickstarter is that Charles, I think Charles, this guy, is was a very he was a very happy and successful doctor and Is that a voice just now well, he just heard a voice his wife passed away and since then he's been sort of lost and he's trying to find himself it's and get his life back together it's news voice that was his wife oh there she is the ghost I'm on my way. Doctor, focus. 
We'll be gone in no time at this rate. Charles, get a grip. Uh oh. Come. I've lost the. Uh oh. Let's just. Ah, that won't work. He's trying to do his surgery. Unsuccessfully. Oh no. <sighs> Time of death six fifty two AM. Let's go and face the family. Oh no. How is he, Doctor? I Speak up, man. I'm sorry, our doctor worked very well until the end. But the scarring was too severe. Doctor, speak for yourself. Why is he speaking for you? Just... I am so sorry. Where do you think you're going? We're very sorry for what happened today. I'll be back shortly. Until then, please wait here with Mrs. Yamauchi. Charles! What are you thinking? Just let me go this time, James. Nothing will improve if you just disappear. Recently, it's just one fail after another. Look, you just do your best and face the outcome. Nobody expects you to do magic in there. Yes, they do. And I used to be able to do it too. Well, you may be right. But you can't just throw away your life's work now. You worked too hard to get to this point. You're right. We did. She wouldn't want to see you this way. Just come down. All right. But I'm only sparing you the sight. Come on. You need to go home and take a rest. You all be okay without me? Look, Charles, you failed at your last three surgeries. You need to sort yourself out. You know we have major surgery planned for tomorrow at three. I'm really not feeling so up to it. But they requested you specifically, and you accepted. They did. James, I've been thinking and... Depending on how surgery goes tomorrow, I might just... You're thinking of quitting? It's just different now that she's gone. I'm different. It's up to you, Charles. I'll just say, don't forget all the years you pushed yourself to get to this point. I couldn't do it without me. I can't do it without We were a team. I know that. Take some time for yourself. Rest up, relax, socialize, study. Most of all, find a reason to go on. If you need anything, just give me a call. My number is 229-2512. Check your notepad. Thanks, James. I'll deal with today's paperwork. Forget about today. Focus on yourself. See you tomorrow. Statistics, energy, stress, social, wits, fulfillment. Press M to see them. Aside Charles, several statistics are on display. Statistics will increase or decrease with each action you take. High stats are vital to success. There we go. So, this is another one of the... Oh no, I didn't mean to go back in the hospital. 
Um. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely leave the hospital. One of the things about oh this, how did I get on the roof? One of the things about this that um seem kind of that were kind, that's kind of unique is the um. There's the open world aspect of it. There's like this RPG aspect of it too. So you have your cell phone. You can call people. Um, email. Oh wow, there's a lot of stuff. Email, you like got phone. You can call people. Music. Okay. Um. Can I go back? There we go, okay. And then you kind of walk, so, the idea is that you have your day off here. He's trying to, like, get his stuff sorted out and, and kind of find, find what he needs. And you just kind of have all of Tokyo, I mean, in concept, that's what they're going for. You have all of Tokyo to just sort of explore and figure out your stuff. Obviously, this demo does not have all of Tokyo in it, but you get the idea. So, can I interact with stuff? That seems like not, but these people probably. <laughs> what are you coughing for? You trying to make a point? Ooh. If you got a problem, you should probably spit it out right now before my friend here gets mad. I wasn't really making a point, but you are aware it's legal to smoke here, right? You're pretty smart, huh? Trying to start a fight with three guys. Mm. I'm not really interested. I love in their that. menacing crouch. <laughs> Looks like this guy's not afraid of you, Kaz. Get out of here now. Okay, well, these guys are not worth talking to. A bunch of jerks crouching there, smoking in the shrine. What about you? Hello, fellow. Oh, young man. Can I ask you something? Mm, I guess so. Well, it's my job to pick up litter around here, and I, I always do a pretty darn good job. Well, that's very nice. But today... On top of the gate, there's a can I just can't get to. I've been doing this job flawlessly for years. If that can isn't disposed of before I get <laughs> off work, my reputation oh, will be ruined. I see, but I don't really see what I can do. How did it even get up there? I bet it was those darn riffraffs over there. They're always causing trouble around here. Well... I'll let you know if I think of anything. Well, thank you, Sonny. I'll be here until my shift ends at 7.45. I might get desperate before then, though. In that case, I'll just get the ladder out, I guess. All right. What? I hear you. If he's got a ladder, what's the problem? All right, well. Wait, I want to see what happens if I talk to the kids again. Hey guys. No, oh, no, okay. Another thing I want to mention about this game that they mentioned in the campaign this demo was created by the artist, sort of as a proof of concept for the game, and in I don't know what engine or development thing, but the final product, this isn't. You know, it's the, it's it's a concept demo, but the final product is being remade in Unity by programmers, actual programmers. Can I go in the street, but it's not okay. That would be scary. Um, and it'd be a lot more, a lot more polished. A lot, you know. That's this is purely to get the feel and the concept. Ooh, we got a close-up little outside Charles. Oh, okay. I do have to say, he did an incredibly good job putting it together, that aside, because... Oh, bus schedule. Wow. 
extremely thorough bus schedule. When they're saying, for the sake of this demo, the bus is on a call system and you can call the bus freely from the circle. In the final version, the bus will come and go according to the timetable. Cool. Um, cool. Thank you. So how would I... So I guess I would stand there. I don't want to call the bus yet, but... You can lock and unlock the door with the code and your keypad. 3727. Remember to lock the gate when leaving the house. Forgetting to do so could end up in undesired consequences. Hmm. Let's see. Three. Wait. Leave this window, press backspace. Okay. Three. Seven. Two. Seven. Pin valid. Okay. And it's unlocked. Now it's unlocked. And I can go on in. That's a lovely little yard. I haven't really mentioned the art yet, but I love it. I really, I, this like sharp edged pixel art is, is very in right now. And it's really interesting that there's no aliasing around the characters. They're just like sharp edges. I think it's very cool. All right, Charles home. Just got myself a sweater, got myself a baseball key item baseball to prepare <laughs> oh my god oh I missed that because I was laughing too hard how do I I'm I totally missed oh crap should I just press all the keys until I find it is it in the is it in the pause menu maybe I can figure it out um He's got himself a laptop, a projector screen, maybe? That's really cool. Anything this way? Oh, you can, oh, that's really cool. Wait, look at, you can see the outline of the rooms in black. That's really neat. So there's a room upstairs from here. From there, I guess, there's, cause it's connected. There's a room here. Wow. That's really cool. It's in the fridge. Discovered the key item wallet. It seems useful. That's the end of this way, but I gotta go upstairs too. Oh, that was nice. That's a nice transition. Bedroom. I don't want to sleep. Let's see if there's anything over here to interact with. No. Will I s Oh no, I went to sleep. No, Charles. You have stuff to do. You have your life to live, Charles. That's okay. It's just a demo. This <laughs> is the demo. Um. Whoa. What on earth is that? I left the gate open. <sighs> well, I, I don't know if that was a dream or a burglar. <laughs> it was super weird. Oh, it's a dream. Oh my goodness. It's a dream with boss fight music. One other thing they did mention in the in the Kickstarter, oh, it's the Matrix too. Was that you kind of get to do battle with his subconscious, and it has some effect on his real life kind of the way you interact with his subconscious in his dreams, which is very interesting. This is freaking me out. Whoa! Giant crazy-eyed Charles, is that who that is? It kind of looks like him. He's got the same tie, jacket color, pants. 
Except he's got. It is. It's Kreklas. Which is an anagram of Charles. Dreams are the weird. Last part, I was kind of floating. And these ghost like creatures were cheering for this reckless to cut me up. Ford, you listening? Ford. It was you who did it. What? You killed her. Oh, killed it's a dream in a dream. Ah. Well done, you've completed the healing process Tokyo demo. If you didn't find the secret room, I went to sleep by accident. Want to return to the game and search around for your chance to win the prize? Whoa. If it is currently between the 1st of September, it is, and the 1st of October, it is, you may want to visit the Kickstarter and continue back in the game. That's right. I'm going to go back and restart and explore a little more. Oh no, I will be transported back to Charles' house. Thank you, game demo. For letting me do that. I think. Yes! Thank you, Demo, for not letting- not making me restart the game. This is nice. Um... Because I've had to do that a lot. I don't think I'm gonna find the secret room. Necessarily. Um... Because if it, if you have to win a if 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 it wins you a prize, it's probably really well hidden, and I don't necessarily have time to do that. I am not sure how to leave my house though. Because I thought that was where I came in, but this brings me upstairs. It was the X button. Okay. That was really just a matter of click all the things until something works. And let me lock the gate. Three, seven, two, seven. And gate locked. Now I gotta see where else I can go. If the bus can take me somewhere, there's a lot more to explore. Someone is pacing and washing them. There's a guy drinking all those cans. Maybe they're the one. He's the one who put the thing up on the thing. Hello, thirsty vagabond. Can I talk to you? No. Excuse me. Okay. No. All right. Well. Oh well. No big deal. Is there anything else? I'm just running down the side of the highway. I wonder if anything is even this direction. I'm 
I'm just gonna hit a wall. You should take the bus to Central Tokyo rather than Central Tokyo rather than walking in the middle of the road. I agree, sir. Walking in the middle of the road, maybe not the best plan. I wish I could ask this guy something, but oh well. Um Can I walk back through this? Oh yeah, okay, so it didn't make me go through that sketchy thing again. That's cool. I should get on the bus. Whoa. All right, so I can go to two places. I can go to the bar, which is, I guess, where I had that dream, and the graveyard. Guess I should go to the graveyard. Oh, and they're highlighted different colors, probably to indicate what stats they'll increase, which is pretty neat. I'm going to go to the graveyard, I think, right now, and do a little mourning, which is not, like, super fun, but if, if I'm trying to move on, get my life back together, maybe that'll be helpful. I lost my walk animation. That's, oh, there we go. There's some mourning happening. I'm gonna guess that this is mine here. This is where she rests. I often come here to spend time together with Miu when I'm not in the surgery. I feel at ease in this place. From time to time, I'll see families of other patients here. Patients who I couldn't help, and I offer them flowers for their loved ones. It's the least I can do. Well, that's sad and sweet. My energy is through the roof. Stress, social wits, fulfillment. Well, it didn't increase any of those things, but I'm learning. Learning about him. And what he does and who he is. Which is kind of the point of an interactive fiction game anyway. Just kind of exploring and learning. Take the bus back to your house, yep. Let me... I want a cell phone. Let's try the cell phone. Wait, notepad. What's in my notepad? James's cell, gate code. Okay. Okay, journal. Oh, we got some writing. Contents, Charles Diary. Charles L. Russell, age 29. Birthday, July 25th, 1989. So this takes place in the near future. That's interesting. Nationality, British, Japanese. Profession, doctor, surgeon. Language is British, English, Japanese. Hobbies, guitar, piano, songwriting, video games. <laughs> Heavy, not anymore drinking, generally depressed. I was born into a family with very little money. I always wanted to live in Japan since I was young and finally moved here when I turned 23. Summer 2016, I lost my wife Miyu in a traffic accident. If only I had been by her side, I could have saved her. Things just aren't quite the same now. Miyu Russell. Formerly Takuchi. Age 28. Japanese surgeon. Hobbies, reading, piano. Birthday, March 21st. Miu was always kind of was always kind and sensitive. We studied together at university, and we even worked at the same hospital. She would always say, "You can't get back time that you've lost, but you have the ability to give time to others." Charles, whenever I was down, she would always be the one to pick me up. Miu was the perfect partner. Furukawa Haruka, surgeon's assistant. Oh, this is the this is some the other person in the in the, in the surgery. Haruka was there when I first set foot in the surgery. She was the first person to talk to me, and she showed me around. Miu was always jealous that there was another woman working alongside me. Haruka always keeps me in check in the operation theater and believes in my ability no matter what the situation. If it weren't for Haruka and James, I probably would not be here. At the hospital, I mean. And he crossed out, be alive. <laughs> James, this is the guy that was talking to me. He's also British. James moved to Japan when he was 15. His parents divorced, and naturally his mother returned to live in Naga Nagasaki with her family. James is very easy to annoy, but the things he says are almost always spot on the mark. If James tells someone to do something, better do it before James finds out. First met James when I started working at the hospital. Parents of the last patient I let down. Oh, no. Their son was rushed into surgery with a heart attack, despite having just turned 20 years old. If only I wasn't such a mess, I could have helped them. I also left the surgery in quite a hurry. It was so rude of me. I need to visit their house and apologize. I'm sorry. Punk number one. So these are literally all the characters that I've met. 
or that are available in the demo, I'm sure. <laughs> Punk number one. He's this, he's smarter and more manipulative than he lets on. I should be careful around him. Punk number two. Kaz was crouched outside the shrine with his friends, was agitated that I coughed near his friend. Hot-headed. Punk number three. He was with the other two guys. He doesn't seem talkative. Manage grunt. Seems the strongest. Jiro. He was outside of the shrine every day dreaming of sushi. It's a flawless reputation. Wow. Dan, I didn't meet yet. I might still. Best friend since we were young. I mean, not good. He's a professional photographer and photo editor. With good time playing, drinking, and playing video games. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of info. Very thorough. Character guide, and then probably there will be quests in here at some point. Notepad, I should call... Well, let's see. Let me call everybody. Whatever. Let me call... Hey, Dan. Daniel. Right? <laughs> it's rare to get a call from you. How are you doing? Yeah, I've had a lot on my mind lately. Don't worry about it. I know you've been through a lot. Well, it's already been quite a while since she left. Charles, you've had a hard year. Have you been sleeping well? <laughs> you can call it sleeping. <laughs> How's Hannah? Uh, she must be seven already. That's right, yeah. <laughs> She's growing up fast. And, um, actually, I think Sophie might be pregnant again. Wow, well, congratulations. I'm thinking... Maybe I should come visit you in Japan. It's been ages since I've visited you. What was it, about a month after you got married or something? Except Dan's well, offer, really? yeah. Obviously. Like. That sounds great. And I'm sure there's plenty of space in your house. Uh, I know. We can drink and play video games right into the morning. Just like we did in high school. That sounds school. pretty good, actually. <laughs> if I'm honest, I didn't think that day would come round again. <laughs> so when can you come? Well, actually I'm in London. And on a break from work. So, I'll fly right over. <laughs> I'll probably arrive in exactly... 13 hours from now. That's pretty soon. Great. Nice, do Dan. You remember where I'm living? The best oh, of bros. It. It all rain down. Just be at your house 13 hours from now, okay? Got it. See you soon, Dan. See ya. Wow, that... Now that is a friend. <laughs> you are having a hard time. He is going to pick up and fly from London to Japan to hang out with you. Nice job. All right. Never got through to that guy. I'm saying he's always busy. <laughs> I bet he's asleep. Alright, and now let me call James. 229 Hey James. I'm having second thoughts about the surgery tomorrow. Nothing will improve if you just disappear. Yeah, I guess you're right. Look, you just do your best and face the outcome. Nobody expects you to do magic in there. Okay. I'll see you later. Okay. What happens if I call another... Like, just try to call anything. Doesn't work. Okay. That would... That, that is probably a fun thing to be implemented at some point, I would imagine. Um, oh, T is to throw the ball. That's helpful. Okay, return to game. Oh, I can throw the ball to knock the can down. That is what I can do. Let me go do that before I, I take the bus to the other place. Shriner, I'm running at the speed of this car. That's not bad. Maybe, maybe one of the things Charles can do to find fulfillment is he can be a marathon runner or some kind of racer of some kind all right now I slept until morning so the poor guy isn't there anymore but this is awesome oh yeah Jiro dreams of cans is gone but 
I, d I helped him out. I helped him out. Alright, so let me head back to my house. And... Get on the bus and go to wherever the other places that I can go. I don't remember what it was. Not the cemetery. Echo Bloom coming 2016. I wonder what that is. Maybe another game? Perhaps? Okay. Oh, the bar. Right. Ford's bar. It seems that I can't take the bus to the bar. That's okay. I called him. He's busy. He's probably not there anyway. So I think that's all there is for me to do in this demo now. At this point, I've kind of... I went to all the places. So... I didn't find the secret room, but that's okay. Um, it probably has something to do with the quest with the can and stuff. And he's gone, so I can't do that anymore. This is really interesting. I love how... Um, how much there is. Like, you have all these stats that you can increase. You've got your journal. You've got, like, all that stuff. Um, you've got all, you know, all this stuff. I'm sure there's going to be more in this notebook. You know, you have quests. Like, this is a very... It's its definitely like an interactive fiction exploration kind of game, but there's a lot of game to it, which is very cool. I definitely see what they're going for. I think it's very, very interesting and worth checking out. So, this game is still on Kickstarter. If you want to give it a little back, help bump it up. I don't know where it is right now as I release this video, but they can always use help, so if you're interested, go check it out. And regardless, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.